God damn it! JF yells out after being awoken by someone using the metal door knocker. He frustratedly gets off the bed and puts on some sweatpants and a t-shirt. He heads off the door to see John, the maintenance man, standing outside. A short, skinny guy, probably in his 50s or 60s. JF had talked with him before and concluded that he had a Napoleon complex. I was told to hear that uh, some noises in your place. Wanderers. Lacey opens the door to Bob's quarters. Bob lies on his bed listening to jazz, pretending to be a conductor by waving a pencil around using his mouth. Lacey pulls a face, a bit like she's just stood in something nasty. We are coming out of this wormhole now, Bob. What in God's name is this? It's jazz, Lacey. It's what sophisticated people my planet listen as the to. online commerce has increased, so has the problem of fraud because e-commerce offers so many tools for fraud. Because the scams are online, it is easy to obtain and sell identity information, create false identities, and hack into customer and merchant accounts. And for the most part, as previously noted, law enforcement can do very little to combat such scams because there are so many fraud cases and the fraudsters are often in other jurisdictions and easily disappear.